the graph of voltage versus time. Voltage is along y axis and time is along x axis. We select a suitable scale say x axis 1 centimeter is equals to 10 seconds for x axis and y axis we take it as 0 0.5 volts along y axis. And when we plot the graph for charging we see that the corresponding points are marked with respect to time and the saturation is observed here. Further the same value is retained for discharging and from there it gradually decreases to 0. At a point of time we see that both charging curve and discharging curve intersect and that time is noted as T half. It is the time at which the capacitor is charged to half of its capacity. So, the time is called as T half. This time is measured and that is used for calculating the dielectric constant. We have the formula for calculation of the dielectric constant which is equals to D into T half into 10 power minus 6 divided by 0 0.693 into epsilon naught A into R, where D is the thickness of the dielectric material and T half is calculated from the graph and 10 power minus 6 is the correction factor. And in the denominator we have epsilon naught which is the permittivity of free space which is a constant value and that value will be given. And A is the area of the plates of the capacitor which will be also given and R is the resistance that we have connected in the circuit that we have used 10 kilo ohm resistor. So, we can substitute for resistance.